The centre court of the Rio Open as of this year is to be named Guga Querton, after the greatest Brazilian tennis player of all time. The charismatic Querton, a former world number one, won the French Open three times as well as picking up 20 ATP World Tour titles. And he's still a role model hero to his adoring Brazilian tennis fans. But even for a man who is as loved as Guga, the honour of having a court named after you is not something he can get used to easily. Uh, it's uh, one of these things that you, you cannot Im imagine that far once you start to play tennis. Even uh, get all this success to, to become a number one in slams was very far from my, my hopes. Imagine to, to have a court, uh, I, I told uh, down there uh, during the ceremony that the first time I came to this club for a challenge I lost in the first round, <laughs> went out of the court very upset <laughs> and uh, now this big opportunity to, to come around, uh, still getting myself close to the tennis atmosphere that I, I, I really love. It. Uh, I will let the players blame the court. Is that a problem in the, <laughs> during the match? No, it's okay. Blame, blame myself. Blame Google. So it's, it's, uh, you can uh, feel free about that. And uh, we need uh, this atmosphere that we have in the real open that maintains over a couple of months and a an year to celebrate again to, to the next. Uh, that's uh, how you develop. Uh, brilliant ideas and uh, brilliant projects. Uh, I'm sure the, the greatest tournaments in the world start like this, the, the greatest uh, projects start with uh, the, the first step, so we need to, to believe and uh, we have uh, the crowd uh, that help me and uh, embrace this uh, very much, so it's a great opportunity.